What's up, friends? It's Voltfire Core. We are going to be reviewing the next episode of ReZero, the final one, episode 38 or something, and this one was nice. Perfect ending to the series. Dunce, what did you think about it's this one? It's not an ending. Well, <laughs> ending to the part. Pause. Yeah, yeah. They, pause. they paused it, and then they're going to bring it back. Um, it actually turns out they're bringing it back inside of early 2021, so I'm happy. That's all I wanted. More ReZero. That's, that's cool. So, Dunce, um, as we saw inside of this episode, we got more of your least favorite witch, the Witch of Wrath, which... I hate that bitch. I hate that bitch, bro. She is so bad. Her fashion statement is disgusting. No, it's not. She's nice. I like her. No, no, you're wrong. I'm wrong? Damn, man. You are wrong, Stu. Well, what's so bad about her? Like, I know just her fashion sense, but I think she's cool. She has a nice personality. I like... She... she she's... she's ugly. She has ugly-ass hair. I hate that hair, dude. She... her personality is... is annoying as fuck. Damn. Right? Uh... And, you know, she... 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 she, she has hearts when she punches things, and that's cringe, alright? It's kind of cute. I don't know. Like, I thought it was kind of weird, because whenever you see, like, cutesy stuff inside of ReZero, you kind of expect something bad to happen. And he did, he had, like, a mental no. breakdown, so, you know. But yeah, no. Subaru, he had a mental breakdown, and, you know, kind of just like inside of Part 4, a bunch of females kind of just helped him out. Ram, or Rem, helped part, him out. Part, part 4. Part, part 1, sorry. There, there's no JoJo here. No, no JoJo. <laughs> Yeah, it was part four, bro. Jesus Christ. I know mean, this anime is so big. Well, you know, it's, uh, it's ReZero's Unbreakable or something. Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, ooh, ooh. Um, Subaru has a nice conversation which, uh, with the Witch of Envy, which, you know, long awaited. I've been waiting to see that kind of conversation for, uh, for a fat minute. Yeah, yeah. I really hope one day, um... We actually get to see like if she is Amelia or not, like kind of. No cap. Yeah, like I don't know. She seemed kind of depressed. She kind of freaks me out. Just like Subaru said, they'll have their real weird ideals to uh, get what they want, and you know they're gonna get Listen, that. They're witches, bro. Like the. the they're like succubuses, alright? They're just trying to use Subaru's small brain to get his epic power of re revamping the dead. Like, he's a weird zombie man, like, what, like, Thriller's playing on right now. Like, everyone's popping out of the graves, dude. That's him. I thought Ekidona was the only one that wanted to use him. All the others, they kind of just, like, like him, I think. Nah. Nah, nah. They, they, they all want to use him, too. I guarantee it. I guarantee fucking tea it. Yeah, I found it cool that Daphne, or aka like Sarcophagus Lolly, she actually like wanted uh, Subaru to do that. I don't like a lady. CG man, the CG Lolly. No. Nah. Well, whatever. Moving on. So actually, not moving on. That's like that 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 takes up like half of the episode, and then they leave, and we get more of uh, Patrash or the land. <laughs> <laughs> Dunce, what the fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> all right so for for the record dunce is um you know we're both on discord right now he decided he wants to uh showcase his beautiful face so he can uh yeah i'll never know what i look like um yeah i'll probably have to showcase your crappy tiktoks one day one day I, no no you know what no put put my tiktok in there right now Well, for the record, Dunce is going to be editing in this, so clap it up for yeah. Dunce. Clap it up. Dunce, you, you go ahead and do that. Yeah, Dunce. Yeah, you got this. <laughs> uh, my, editing, my editing's epic, bro. My editing is fucking epic. We'll see if Dunce is able to surpass Volt Firecore's edits. But anyways, he leaves that, and Otto, oh my god, Otto, not, not Volt Firecore gay for Otto. <laughs> He's not gay anymore. Hashtag... Voltfirecore gay for Odo, hashtag Voltfirecore pedo, hashtag Voltfirecore lollyking420, hashtag Voltfirecore simp on sim September. It's, it's almost not September, it's gonna be October, like, very soon. 
Wait, no. Is it September? Yeah, it's September. Okay, then you, you gotta stop playing around with your uh, with your camera, man. <laughs> okay, okay, whatever, <laughs> whatever. Next, um, yeah. So basically, the biggest thing, well, the only thing I really found extremely insane was his whole conversation with uh with Rosewald. Dude, that voice actor is like the best voice actor of all time. Like, not only he plays Dio like an absolute god, but come on, every single time he said something, it was weird. It was creepy. I just love him so much as a character. Rosewald is just, I don't know, like you think like a Bozo the Clown kind of looking motherfucker would be kind of like weird, but no. Bozo He got this like weird accordion music going on inside the background. He got this like way of saying things. And it's, it's creepy as hell, but really kind of, kind of cool. So anyways, Rosewald, he's been reading the book. He is a genius. He's been decoding all of this shit. And he knows, like, he knows everything that, um, he's been doing just from, like, process of deduction. And he's perfectly fine with throwing away his entire life just to get information. And this time we figured out that he's actually testing Subaru. Oh my god. So all, all the time... Wait a minute, wait a minute. So, Rosewald hired the witch to take out... No, Rosewald hired the bounty hunter, Elsa, to take out the castle, right? Do you think he did that in okay. episode one? This is, this is what he's doing. He's testing Subaru's resolve, alright? Yeah. He's actually just testing him to get, like, extra power points or something. He's making him stronger to, like, make decisions he's making, on the fly. He's making him stronger so that he can use him as a powerful, powerful man. More as a weapon. Like, I'm not really sure, but his goal has to be something absolutely insane. He needs Amelia Listen, to... The man's the man's deal, alright? He knows what he's talking about. Yeah, the man's kind of a legend. He's trying his very best to get what he wants. And if that involves taking out people, taking out himself, Amelia, that's really all that needs to be happening. Dunce, okay, I swear to God, like, not <laughs> not only you're blocking your microphone, but... <laughs> dude, dude, that's some x-ray stuff right there, alright? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're gonna have to explain that, or I don't know. Go explain that or something. Explain what you're doing. Um, so I'm being a savage. All right, you heard it here first. So, anyways, Rosewald, I have to put him like I think by far he's my favorite character so far. Like I don't want to be that guy. Um, I mean, like to be honest though, like I think for Cat Bro, he's kind of simping for. Uh, <laughs> Everyone's simping. He, 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 he was all like, yo, man, why you hate me so much? And then he was like, I could never hate you, homie. I love you. I thought he was going to say, like, Subaru, ski I was going to be like, no, don't, don't be saying that. Cringe, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. But anyways, after that, he kind of just runs away. And Otto, the man himself, he just tells him, yo, you're not alone. Because even inside the first section with the witches... The witches, the witches were just like, yo, don't try to, like, get your way out of things by murdering yourself. Try to help. Like, because that's fucked up, yeah, bro. get help, get that's help. fucked up. It's a good commentary on, like, you know, people trying to accomplish things on their own. You know, you can get help out there. Personally, I really hate getting help, but, you know, Subaru, he needs to get that help. Especially from Otto, because Otto's gonna help him. You like Otto? The dunce gay for Otto, or nah? Yeah? Nah, the dunce's not gay for Otto, but, like... If, if I could pick a husbando man, Odo's a pretty good candidate. Rip, uh, Reagan from Mob Psycho and Odo from um, ReZero Man, those are top tier husbandos if I was a female. If I was Samantha... Yeah. Who's Samantha? Yeah. If, if my name was Samantha, that would be my husband. <laughs> Why would your name be Samantha? How would I name myself Samantha? Yo, Dunce, your, like, FaceTime thing that you're doing right now, staring at me really creepily, is lagging you so hardcore that you're, like, glitching out, man. So it's either turn that off, or, like, you're gonna have to, like, fix your computer, because you got, like, a potato computer going on right now. Yeah, yeah. Okay, he's just gonna keep dancing over here. But, yeah, that is pretty much everything that happened inside the episode. 
I loved this uh, quote-unquote season of ReZero. You could consider it a part. So I'm really looking forward to the next part of ReZero, which is happening inside of early inside the year. Dunce, what do you think is going to happen? Like, what's happening? The next, the next episode? Yeah. Well, yeah, in like four months. Odo. Odo and um, Subaru are going to devise a plan to, um, you know, figure out how to save everyone in the mansion and kill Rosewald. Why would they kill Rosewald? Is Rosewald bad? Rosewald not bad. bad. Okay. What he has to do is he has to okay. go over to. You, no, no, no. You have been conditioned to think that, and was was actually true, is that he's actually the bad guy. Everybody's been like, "Yo, he's the good guy, man," but actually, he's the bad guy. Eh, like I think his motives probably are gonna be pretty disturbing when we learn them, since. He doesn't really care about murdering people or getting, you know, he, he's kind of one of those do whatever is necessary to accomplish his goal. What, what Subaru needs to do to accomplish his goal is get Beatrice over there so she can fucking nuke the bunnies. The bunnies and Elsa are the problem. You just gotta take out Elsa. He did it before with Reinhardt. You gotta do it. You gotta do it somehow. That's true. And that is next season. But Dunce, thank you for this season we'll probably have to do a review of another anime series since this was pretty fun finishing statements for this season or something uh this well this part of the season very epic very top-notch very high quality i like it but i think they might probably fuck up the other half of it i don't know Who knows? <laughs> why say uh, that why say that <laughs> I, I don't know, I, you can't have that good of like a first part of a season and then like not have it be fucked up at the end. Have you ever watched like fucking sequels of any movie? Come on. Well, you see anime is different. Like Darling and the Franks, kind of bad, but you know, it's, you know, it, it doesn't matter. They, they're going to try their best and hopefully by that time Rona is a little bit better so they can dedicate hardcore time. Yes. Hopefully, and I am excited to see how how this uh, season ends. And I think Rosewald is bad guy. I love Rosewald so much. I love him, but yeah, th th that's what they wanted. That's what they wanted, bro. They're trying to get you attached to this guy, so that like they're, they're doing Demon Slayer, but they're doing it the right way, right? They're trying to give like nice uh, humanization to the character, and then he's gonna go all like bad. Even and, if and he's totally evil, sad when he dies. I'm gonna love him. I'm gonna love him even if he's the biggest douchebag. But with that being said, guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for this season, and keep on lookout for my videos.